All right. So thank you for coming to my speech today. I will be speaking today on Toyota's success. Founded prior to World War II, Toyota has been in business since 1937. That's almost 85 years. But that wasn't just the day a successful company began. An entire culture was born that day. Toyota has built a brand like no other and is more successful even as time goes on. Today, the main points I'll be speaking of are Toyota's rise as an, economic, as an automotive powerhouse, Toyota's economic prowess in America, and the ethics that drive Toyota to success. Starting off, Toyota's rise as a powerhouse is like none other, but it hasn't happened overnight. One of the biggest leaps they had to take was the implementation of the just-in-time system started in 1938. The just-in-time system is basically having parts ready only as they're needed on the production line. This eliminates stockpiles of parts that can be wasteful with money and time. One of the next big things that gave Toyota a bump in the world was World War II. The war gained Toyota an economic advantage like none other, having the fact that they produced the large majority of Japan's military vehicles. Overall, Toyota employed many important tactics and were employed in crucial ways to begin their prowess in the automotive industry. One of the next points I'll be talking about is the rise of Toyota in America with inexpensive economy cars. Obviously, the first step was the establishment of Toyota Motor Sales USA Incorporated. After this establishment, in 1958, Toyota showed off the Crown and the Land Cruiser in America for the first time at the Los Angeles Import Motor Show. The Crown was an affordable sedan with good economy compared to its American counterparts, and the Land Cruiser was and still is Toyota's pride and joy. And obviously, who wouldn't want to show that off? But these are not the vehicles overall that made Toyota such a power in America. The introduction of the Corona and the Corolla in the 1970s, which were both value and economy cars, are what brought to Japan into America. This came especially at a time when safety, economy, and value were not doing so well from their American counterparts. Toyota introduced a car that was good on gas, reasonably priced, and very safe compared to companies like GM and Ford Motor Company. Overall, while it may have taken nearly 20 years for Toyota to gain a following in America, the Corolla would go on to be the face of economy for Toyota in America. The last main concept I'm going to discuss today is Toyota's values and ethics. It's established on five main principles, which I will read to you directly from Toyota's corporate website. Always be faithful to your duties, thereby contributing to the company and to the overall good. Always be studious and creative, striving to stay ahead of the times. Always be practical and avoid frivolousness. Always strive to build a home-like atmosphere at work that is warm and friendly. Always have respect for spiritual matters and remember to be grateful at all times. These five main guiding principles are part of the reason that Toyota has been so successful. They're putting the power of the company in the hands of the people making all of their products. And lastly, their corporate philosophy, which I will also read directly from the corporate website. Seeking harmony between people, society, and the global environment and sustainable development of society through marketing. Toyota has always held themselves and others with respect, and with respect comes success, as is clearly evident in today's showing of Toyota. All in all, Toyota is an automotive powerhouse with deep roots in respect and efficient production methods. Toyota rose as an automotive powerhouse. They have an economy prowess in America. 
and the ethics that drove Toyota to success were established back then and continue through today to make Toyota shine in the world. With so many followers today, Toyota did build a culture. And with so many automotive companies in the world, there's a clear reason why Toyota has the biggest reach. They're simply the best. <laughs>